Welcome in, Raiders. Thank you so much, Daichi. What are you doing? Seeing a lot of new faces here. Almost everyone here is probably new. Uh, welcome in. My name is Avia Red, but you can call me Ave. I'm a support class VTuber. Today we're going to be playing some more Fire Emblem Engage. We're good and you're not stinky? Glad to hear it. At least someone takes a shower here. Roko! Meow. Welcome in, Roko. Realigi, thank you so much for the follow. Sleepy, little sleepy one. Welcome to the, uh, welcome to Edenheart. Hope everyone's doing well today. Nice. You're play you were just chatting. What were you talking about? I am fashionably late, but that is because I decided to cat. You guys were talking about cats? H E, do you like cats? Or are you talking about this cat next to me? Point at this cat. Try pointing. This cat. This cat's name is Bruno. There's a command you can use to pet Bruno. Free to use it. It's only 10 points. We beat Half Life 2 Episode 1 early, so then we played some Scribblio and watched Dinosaur videos. Nice, 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 nice. I. Was definitely there uh, back when you were playing Half Life One, but I'm not, not sure if I was present for when you started Half Life Two. We don't talk about Bruno. No, we talk about this Bruno. I love this cat. All right, I will never stop talking about this cat. You guys want to know more about this cat? I will tell you about Bruno because I love talking about Bruno. Bruno here was a rescue cat. All right. You know what makes Bruno awesome? He is huge, all right? He is the size of my torso. What makes Bruno even more amazing is that one day, soon after he was adopted and rescued, I mean, uh, he was having some issues with uh, his body. He was like scratching at it, cut, uh, biting at it. So then he was taken to the vet. And then the vet had found out that Bruno, be <laughs> Bruno actually had bullet fragments inside of him. Someone had shot at Bruno with a 22 millimeter, and he had bullet fragments in him, just like Tony Stark, okay? And he was perfectly fine. He tanked that bullet, um, and but pieces of the metal were coming out of his body. So every, every once in a while, um, you'll see bullet fragments come out of him. But like, he, he took that shit. And he didn't even complain. <laughs> Bruno's an amazing cat. Axie, welcome! Thank you for patting Bruno. I love this cat, alright? Bruno's amazing, and he's not even my cat. I just love having him around. Axie knows. Axie has met Bruno and given Bruno plenty of pets. I'm very jealous about it. I want to meet Bruno one day. <laughs> but yes, that's why I love Bruno. He's such an amazing cat. Very stinky. Very cool. Love him. One of the best cats I know. If you want, I can try to find a shot Bruno. It's okay. Bruno's away from that situation now, and that's all that matters. Bruno is now in a loving home, taken care of uh, by Loki and Shathari. Bruno is the best cat, and I want everyone to know about Bruno, so please, keep talking about Bruno. <laughs> okay, um... Bruno's a very happy in his home and is a clever cat. Craft clever cat. <laughs> yes. Um, hope everyone's doing well. I was late because I wanted to... I honestly was craving... Oh. So I went to a pho restaurant on my way home from work, which I was already late uh, heading home from as well. So it really just pushed things back even more. <laughs> Did you know I like you like cats? I do now. He knows how to open pizza boxes and steal jerky from backpacks. <laughs> uh, I think I remember the jerky incident. That was during one of uh, Loki's D and D, um, one of his D and D sessions, right? And I think I remember 
stole your jerky. It was your jerky, Adric? Welcome, welcome. Slap, meow. How y'all doing? All right, it was the ghost pepper jerky, and he was having stomach problems afterwards. I remember this story. Uh, I think, I can't remember if Loki told about it on stream or on Twitter, but it's funny. <laughs> Sleepy kitty that comes as much as a shock as saying you love Kasane Teto? Who's Kasane Teto? Tell me more. Adric, was it good jerky? Ghost pepper jerky. Um, but yes, the pho was very nice. It was very good jerky. Excellent. The two cats, one named Pepper. And so oh, that's so cute! Are they perhaps uh, black and white cats? What kind of cats are they, Sleepy? Oh, they are. Excellent. Okay, but, but is the black cat named Salt and the white cat named Pepper? You need to make more. Oh, you made it. Oh, I was going to ask where you got it from. That's incredible. <laughs> oh, it's good to know that Bruno approves of the jerky, though. <laughs> uh, excellent. Um, thank you for patting Bruno. What a good cat. Uh... I don't know. Not too much has been happening since when did I last stream? I last streamed Sun. No, was it Sunday night? Yes, it was Sunday. Uh, so not a whole lot's happened since then. Really, just <laughs> the past month has been really, really busy at work. So I feel like I just get home late every single day, and it sh it usually isn't the case, right? We're just particularly busy at the start of the month. Um, we're in the middle of a project that uh, we need to make sure is done correctly because we only have one chance and it's a lot of money has been invested in this project to say the least. We need to put in like 110% of our effort to make sure as well. Um, I think we're on track at least but it's, as a result I've had to stay late in order. See technically yes because pepper is black and a bit white and salt is white and a bit black. You, Take the black out and the uh, of salt and the white out of pepper. You get perfectly wh white salt and pepper. Nice. Oh, that's so cute. If you do it the other way, pepper is salt and salt and pepper. Ying and yang kitties. Nice. Are they siblings? Did you get them at the same time? Are they also rescues. Um, but honestly, like work has been ex so exhausting that I haven't been able to get too much sleep either. Uh, but that's not because of work, it's because I have terrible sleep habits. Uh, but yesterday, I think I got home, and I knew that I didn't have to stream. So I went to bed early for the first time in a while. Uh, and I woke up, and I was like, wow, I feel great. <laughs> Did you guys know that sleeping a reasonable amount of hours at a reasonable time makes you feel good next morning? I... Yeah, I'm so shocked. I don't think I'll be able to do it again anytime soon. <laughs> uh, but I'll try. But then if I... If I go to bed at a reasonable time, then what's the point of the redeem? That sounds fake. Neko, you have to believe me. It's true. I've done it. Asane Teto is a vocal synth related, at least for Utaloid. There's a lot of covers for vocal music. Leverton. Oh, okay. Okay, okay, okay. I've I've heard of Teto. I have not listened to very many of her songs. I think I've only heard of one. Um, can't remember the name of it, but I know it's been covered by a lot of VTubers the past couple of years. <laughs> yeah, it definitely doesn't sound real. It's sad because every time I see them together, they're ignoring each other or fighting. Oh, nope, unfortunately, but they used to act like siblings. I wonder why they stopped. Maybe they're in their teenage years and they want to sleep slipper. Roko, you have to believe me, it's true. 
you sleep at a reasonable time for a reasonable amount of hours, you feel great tomorrow. <laughs> If only I could do that more often. Uh, uh to Oh, yes, yes, yes. You're right, you're right. That's it. That's it. It's such a catchy song. <laughs> but I definitely heard the original, like, at least a decade ago. That song is so old. But I think that's the only Teto song that I know of. Um, I was definitely a huge fan of Vocaloid back then. I've since... I don't listen to it as often anymore, at least none of the newer stuff. But sometimes I I, I still have um, my old playlist from like my high school days that I used to listen to every day. I literally had a playlist named every day that I would listen to every day. And it was like 75% vocal. I was a huge fan, mostly of Miku and Gumi song. It was about 50-50 on Miku and Gumi. Sometimes I still, uh, I'll, like, play a few songs for, out of it, uh, sometimes. But these days, I'm usually, um, listening to, like, audiobooks on the week. So, good times. And sometimes when I visit, like, art streams, I'll list, I'll hear artists play, like, old Vocaloid playlists that they find on YouTube, and I was like, oh, shit. I remember all the lyrics from this song. I remember when I first got Pepper, the first thing she did back was get stuck behind a counter. She was scared. Aww. Thought she was okay, though. It seems like you're taking great care of them. That makes me happy. After we got Pepper free, Salt got stuck. Oh, no. Salt just wanted to see what it was like. Abe, I used my magic to turn all of your forks to spoons and spoons to forks. Ahaha, uh, you're so evil. Well, it's okay, Austin. I usually use chopsticks in. Alright. Your, your plan has been foiled. <laughs> right. Um. I leave off on Fire Emblem. Pepper is older, so Salt is probably trying to see what was so good. What's behind here, brother? Actually, no, Pepper is also. Bamboozled again. Better luck next time, Austin. What chapter am I on? I think I'm on chapter 15. Why don't we go take a look? Dimmed. This might look weird. One sec. Alright. I believe I'm on... Chapter 15. You just finished Chapter 10, so it'll be rolling out, but... If you finish Chapter 10, that means you uh, did Chapter 11, right? I'm gonna watch your Chapter 10 VOD to see how you played it. Ah, go for it. Um, shit, what part was that? I want to say that was Part 4, Slab. No, that was two parts in 10? No, it's that was 10 and 11. Because the one immediately after that sequence, you start as chapter 12. When you head into Psalm for the first time, that's chapter 12. Austin's on chapter 19, but you've done with most of the paralogs. I was actually wondering if I should do um, the paralogs now. So Slab, I've done the Lynn and Lucina paralog. Which are unlocked immediately after um, chapter 11. There's two more paralogs that have been released because I got uh, some more emblem rings, which I won't tell you. And I was wondering if I should do that today or if I should do chapter 15. The thing is... MSQ is, like, really easy. Um, so I can definitely manage that at my current level, but the two new emblem paralogs might be a little tricky. But we also never shy away from a challenge, so maybe that might be worth it. The thing is, 
like if I do the paralogs and then do story, it's just going to make story easier because I'll gain levels off of it. Uh, I used to have a cat named Claus, and we gave it gave him a last name Burrito, Claus Burrito. Uh, unfortunately, he only lasted two years. We still have pictures of all. That's unfortunate. Sorry to hear that. Do paralogs and get the challenge. All right, we can do paralogs. Let's go uh, pick up some items first. We'll do our pre-battle preps before we head in and do the paralog. I guess we'll also eat some food so we get some bonus stats. Use only your least used unit. No, I don't want to use Alfred. Take that guy. There's you should have no sway here for these. <laughs> but I appreciate your opinion, Slab. I need your expertise in all things Fire Emblem. Well, hello there. Well, hello oh, wait. Everyone. Slab, don't look. Slab, don't look. You don't know who this is. <laughs> Sorry. Neko, thank you for censoring. <laughs> Bye, Slab. Honestly, if Slab has watched any of the trailers, they do know who this is. I want to buy... Do I want to spend 5,000 gold on stealing gifts? I want to say no. Thank you for patting Bruno. I wish there was a pet Neko button. Now, grilled and ready to go. This meat is so yummy, it's gonna make your taste buds dance. Wow, that seems like a lot of meat for the two of us. Oh no, this one's for me. I was going to do yours next. No, it's a bit odd. I haven't added that. I mean, not everyone wants a pat button. I mean, I don't have a pat button. You guys can't pat Ave. No, no, no. There's no way to pat Ave. Open my mouth, bite, chew. I won't bore you with all the details. Mara, that's not what we meant. Wow. You can pet Abe when he's in intermission. Yeah. Hey, actually, that was a secret. <laughs> Let other people find out. <laughs> Kidding. Uh, yeah. Anyway, I'm still avoiding engage spoilers, so you're out. Good luck with the game. And thank you, Roko. I hope you pick it up soon. Cat. Sleepy, did you know that there are cats in this game, too? What kind of noise was that? If I'm here, they will definitely find out because you do it every intermission. <laughs> Axie, it's actually not just in the intermission. You can also pat Eve in other places. Fortunately, I was very young when we had claws, so didn't know how to take care of a cat, so he never liked you. Pushing much better now. I'm glad you've been learning. That's true. I'm really something. Wait, what did you say? Oh, okay. <laughs> like this conversation was so awkward. I was like, why did she make? I wow, you're so really something, Tamara. Wow, you're really something, Tamara. <laughs> What is happening here? Thank you for patting Bruno. What kind of noise is this? Oh, I forgot to mention, Abe. I just placed your resignation letter from work because uni is starting soon. What the hell is that noise? That's what I'm wondering. Is it like exasperation? Austin, I'm glad you were able to get into a uni. Was it the one that you had mentioned, like, a couple months ago that you were trying to get into? Did she forget to breathe and catching up? Like, so we told her she was, like, amazing. Wow, you're really something, Tamara. And then she says... <laughs> <laughs> what is this? I'm the crown princess of souls! Epset, hello! 
she is dying. <laughs> Call 911. It's okay. Nepsid is here to rescue us. Nepsid, how was Radiant done? You're proud of me. Thank you. Why are you proud of me? Two guys. Nepsid. Welcome in, Raiders! My name is Avia Red, but you can call me Ave. I'm a support class VTuber, and today we are playing Fire Emblem Engage. This is what we call Epic Gaming. Thank you. How you doing, Nepsit? Did you know that Final Fantasy XIV has a free trial that you can play all of A Realm Reborn and the award-winning Heaven's Sword expansion up to level 60 for free with no restriction on playtime? You spend most of these uh, petting Bruno? Go for it. It's only 10 points, and you get more points very quickly. If you follow, you'll get 300 points, but I think you already did sleep. Yes, you did. Deep breath noise? Yeah, it's like a exasperation. Okay, but you know that Fall of C4 is a good game and everyone should go play it? I heard it was a good game. Austin has actually been telling me to play uh, Fire Emblem 4. Alright, your plug is over. You are perfectly fine, Arvis. Just don't start any fires. Just please, keep your voice down. I've heard that this area isn't very safe. You can say that again. <laughs> it's absolutely It's actually cool. funny. So, does he know? <laughs> There was a. I remember on Twitter, right? Um, actually, one of my one of my friends, Miss, welcome in. Good to see you. Uh, one of my friends um, posted in my Discord server about uh, a a bond conversation you can have with um, what's it called with uh, Sigurd between Diamant and Sigurd, right? And it's literally like Diamant tells Sigurd that he's actually afraid of fire because of a an incident that happened when he was a child. And then Sigurd's like, hmm, I also remember a, a pretty poor experience with fire in the past. And it's like, oh no, he's self-aware. Let's see, uh, I love cats so much. I read a book called Warrior Cats because it's about cats. I... Okay, I have not read Warrior Cats, but I have heard about Warrior Cats um, a long time ago. I think back when I still used, like, what was it? I still used Facebook, and I was friends with someone who was really into Warrior Cats. But I, I personally have never, like, uh, read it before. So I'm aware it exists. <laughs> I keep getting Fire Emblem Engage ads on your phone. It's weird. I think it's almost like we keep talking about it. It's almost like the listening axiom. Sigurd also says right after Queen dies, I left a child in death, meaning he knows what he died. Oh. Main cat is, what, Firetail or something? Arvis, have you also read? <laughs> wow, spoiler, it's Fireheart, I see. You haven't gotten any Final Fantasy XIV ads, though? Uh, well, you have, Axie. It's from me. I'm the Fire... fire <laughs> I'm the Final Fantasy XIV ads. You haven't read Warriors since middle school? Wow. It's kind of funny seeing more than, like, multiple people in one place uh, come from completely different uh, parts of the internet know about Warrior Cats. That's why I'm out here like a nice, tempting hunk of lamb on a spit. Wait a minute. That was your plan? To use yourself as bait? It worked, didn't it? Look. Those bruisers have had their eye on us since we got here. Uh-oh. Enemies. Looks like... It looks like they're getting ready for an ambush. What? what? Three people in my chat who have heard of warrior cats. Oh my god. Not if we pounce on them first. Come on. This ought to be a piece of cake for you and me. Especially the cast of characters at the start. It was simple, but the cast name changes it. Helped add to a sense of progression with this. Afraid not? Let's see. 
What's up, Depsit? Haven't read either, but definitely know about the Worry Cats. That's me, Neko. I remember seeing, uh, like, fan art of it on my timeline. That's why I know of it, but I've never actually, uh... Never actually read it myself. Feel free to come again. Heck, we beat up some people. Off screen. Your sad Tamara isn't a dancer? It's okay, you can just make her into one. You just have to give her Byla symbol. Rap stream because a warrior cat died in Radiant Dawn. Does that count? Aww. Rest in peace, Gifka. Rest in peace. I actually need to play Radiant Dawn next. My my partner has been. Uh. <laughs> every once in a while, my partner is like, "So, so, have you streamed Radiant Dawn yet?" Have you, have, you, have you streamed Radiant Dawn yet? How about now? Have you streamed Radiant Dawn yet? Radiant, <laughs> the Telia series is my partner's favorite uh, in the Fire Emblem series. You decided to play FE until you lost a single unit? Telia's is so good. I've I've heard great things. I actually, right next to me. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Okay. In my hand right now, guys. You can't see it, but in my hand, you can see my, my hand tracking, is a physical copy of Radiant Dawn. I've had this since its release. I've never beaten it. Physical copy of Radiant Dawn for the Wii. Still intact, still great. My, my roommate beat this game. My roommate in college beat this game. My copy of Radiant Dawn before I did. I still have not beaten Radiant Dawn. But I should. <laughs> you have physical POR and Radiant Dawn. Slab actually has um, Path of Radiance physical copy. And she was... Uh, sorry, they were streaming it for a little bit. Um, but they stopped in order because they had to play um, Awakening. So Nepset, what chapter did you get in uh, Radiant Dawn? When you when did you leave? When did you lose Grifka? Or is it Gifka? I don't actually recognize that character. Uh, okay. So I think I actually did a little bit of prep before the stream started, but I want to check because I can't remember honestly. Austin, I am not a Fortnite streamer. I only play Fortnite sometimes. A coworker at work gave me a cipher card after finding out you liked FB and you're uh, so happy. I have hundreds and hundreds of cipher cards because I used to play. Um, I used to collect cipher cards and I used to play it too, but I stopped. Um. I stopped playing because I moved out of college and I ran out of I didn't have anyone to play with anymore. But I still have all of it. Let's see, chapter two of the last part, you're going to pick back up on Thursday, though where you left off. Oh, okay. I thought you meant like you you were going to end your run when someone uh died. Not that you were gonna stop uh just take a break from streaming. So this can't be your first time playing Radiant Dawn, right? I feel like you've played before, but I can't remember. I just assume everyone's played Tellius except for me. Don't trust Abe. They have a separate secret Twitch account where he streams only Fortnite. Don't expose me, Austin! No! I'm supposed to be a Fire Emblem streamer now, not a Fortnite streamer. They can't know. You failed to complete it on OG hardware like last year? Ah, I see. Did 
everyone good? I feel like everyone's okay. I did get a shit ton of money. Let's check out the forges and then we'll try that bear log. That job that Aver tell us tells us about is a Fortnite streamer. Hello, Figly. How are you doing? Big Leaf, are you planning on picking up Engage? I don't think I've ever asked you that. Oh wait, I think I already spent like all my money already. Did I? I can't remember honestly. Wow, I am poor. Well, no. I have money, I just don't know crafting materials. All my silver's gone. <laughs> and so is my steel. Oz has convinced you? Wait, hold up. Uh, am I using Boucheron too? I am uh, using Boucheron. Are you engaged to engage? Haha, <laughs> I am feeling very engaged in playing engage. Let's see. Uh, basically, if I don't win the giveaway... Oh, okay. So you have until this Saturday. That actually is a good time. And that reminds me, I should have pinned it. I'm hosting a giveaway. Um, If you want a chance at winning a free digital copy of Fire Emblem Engage, go ahead and head over to that link a couple uh steps you have to take in order to be entered for the drawing but that that's gonna happen on uh just before midnight on saturday you're waiting just in case it it has quite a few uh participants Fig. i wish you luck it would be nice if you won you're not participating only because you have the game <laughs> very thoughtful of you austin but you can always give it away to a friend. Someone else you know who is interested in the game. I don't mind that. Let's see. Don't worry, I spent 30 silver earlier on what? I hope you haven't been upgrading silver weapon. Oh, sure. Welcome in. It's been a while. Hope you're well. What's up? Busy with work? I don't think I've seen you go live in some time, too. And I would have to remember your Twitter login stuff. That's okay if you don't. Actually, I'll secretly enter you in anyways. I'm just waiting for Firestar to pick it up one day. Let's see. Uh... Let me see. Yes, I am using Boucheron. He's actually one of my strongest characters. Well, he's not my strongest character. But he's very uh, formidable. He's been he's been putting in a lot of work for sure, which is so surprising. Because <laughs> Boucheron is like on the lowest tier of everyone's tier lists, and just like my Boucheron is decent, like he's putting in a lot of work. He's not the best character, but he's reliable. But everyone, every single tier list I've seen on online on Twitter. Is like Bushron is like D tier. He's gross, and everyone just puts all the waifus at, at S rank, S tier. Which, to be fair, a lot of the waifus are good. Some of them are a little too high, in my opinion. I would stream engage if I had a capture card. There are some affordable ch capture cards you can use. You don't have to get like a hundred dollar Elgato if you don't. I know Aver Media is a pretty decent um, competitor to Elgato. Uh, you might be able to get their stuff like twenty to forty dollars cheaper than a typical Elgato, and then there's even things cheaper than that for like, you know, forty fifty dollar range as well. I'm just hoping I don't get the decision paralysis paralysis I did with three houses. What do you mean? Uh, what kind of decision paralysis? All right, trying to uh, keep scrolling down. I might copy that link and send it to a friend. Haha, <laughs> you think you have friends? You, Am I not your friend, Austin? You can always give a code to me. Then I'll just give it away again. 
waiting for Ishin to come out too. Oh, yes, yes. I'm. I'm. So you're talking. Uh, Ishin is, uh, basically Yakuza. Um. I'm probably not going to get it, but I would love to watch someone play. Your Twitch days are over for now, unfortunately. Oh, I see. Taking a break from it. Breaks are fine. Um, he does not have a Twitter, so we enter in for him to play it. Ah, okay, cool, cool, cool. You've been busy with work and schoolwork, cosplay, photography, call center job, and your third job. Good luck. All those jobs. Oh, sure. Busy. I do not envy you. I know a lot of people who have to do multiple jobs and attend school. I also, me personally, I had to do a full-time job and attend school full-time. It was not a great experience, but I made it through. I hope you do too. Classic FE, there were so many decisions to make that I spent so long thinking about what would be the best. I ended up not making any decisions. Uh, there's not really any decision making in this game, Big Leaf. Aside from like, oh, which character do you want to play? Or which units do you want to use? Um, but it's not like you have to choose your path or anything. There isn't, as far as I know, there's no decisions to make um, and engage. Besides, like, yeah, basically what whatever you went through in Sacred Stones. Uh, my Louis is hilariously strong in this game, and you love him? My Louis was strong, but I, I'm tempted to bench him. Because his stats just aren't great. Like, his strength isn't too high, especially can, compared to Panette. Uh, his dex isn't high enough to use lances reliably like at 15 you're gonna be missing a ton uh his speed makes it so that he gets doubled by every mage at this difficulty and he only has three reds so he's not going to survive any mage attacks. Uh, and his defense is 28 which is good 28 defense is good but i've also noticed that a lot of enemies uh are starting to deal like 30 plus damage especially since they're wielding silver weapons because he doesn't have a lot of speed. Like, silver weapons are heavy. So they slow people down. To, like, in the 10, 11, 12 range. But because Louis doesn't have high enough speed, he gets doubled by silver weapons. And that's going to take a huge chunk of damage uh, out of his health. Not to mention, uh, if they start swarming him with backup units, then he takes true damage from all the chain attacks. Let's see. They recently announced that Yakuza changed the series name to Like a Dragon to be the same as the Japanese moving forward. Which waifu do you... <laughs> I will keep that a secret for now. Uh, I'm thankful that your parents are willing to support me to finish uni. I'm glad to hear that. My parents were also very supportive when I went back to uni. Because uh, my master's degree was not cheap at all. Um, but they were able to help me pay for it. I paid for it my I paid it a large portion of it um, through my full-time job and when I got my internship, that was a paid internship. And then basically all the money I made during my paid internship went back into paying my tuition for my last year. I'm just so worried you would miss something. It's rational, you know. It's okay, Figly. Just take your time with it. There's really no rush. So like whenever anything happens, just you know, take your time with deciding. And, like, ultimately, any decision you make probably doesn't matter, right? And if, if it does, then just replay the game after. I'm planning on replaying this game as soon as I'm done with it. Because I have to play it on an even harder difficulty. Uh, Louis is doing work for you. His biggest fault is res, and that is bad. Yeah, like, the only res he ever gained was becoming a general. <laughs> and it's one point of res. Um, I think if I go back to three houses, I'll stream and tap chat to help me make decisions. I guess that also works too. Uh, you can also just roll a dice fig leaf. Have you ever tried that? Let, let the, let RNG decide, make your decisions for you. Heavy, just lighten it. <laughs> I forget, what was that about? Were we talking about some sort of weapon? Heavy, heavy, heavy. Hmm. Cousin, what was the context? I can't remember. We talked a lot about a lot of other stuff. Silver being too heavy, yes. Well, silver being heavy is more of an issue for the enemy. For myself, I don't really mind. Uh, especially when, like, you know, Boucheron has 17 build. 
This guy could carry a two-story build and building and wear it, wield it like a weapon. Uh, let's see. Okay, that's not really fair to compare Bennett to Louis. <laughs> but I'm just saying, right? Like, Louis's greatest boon is his high defense. But at this point of the game, where everyone is carrying silver weapons and uh, is doubling Louis, he's starting to fall off. That's all I'm saying. Um... I mean, it, I mean, it looks like that guy's abs have abs. <laughs> he's has like a 10 pack. Yeah. Um, but yes, I made him scantily clad because I don't think berserkers are a good class. I definitely prefer warriors over to berserkers. And that's mostly because berserkers don't have a great personal skill. Like I never use smash weapons because I feel like they're underpowered and under, uh, they're just not very... They don't have great utility. Um, unless it's probably the, the sword smash weapon. Axe smash weapons are almost awful because they always miss. But like warriors, they have the benefit of merciless, which is like pretty decent. It's not amazing, but it's pretty good. And then the other thing that they're great at is that they have access to bows. You just didn't want him to have to learn bows, but looking at him now... I mean, it's not that hard to uh, give him bow if you have uh, Lin and Lucina. I think Lin is level six, which you can just, I mean, like both of both cases, you can just feed them bond fragments till they learn bow. But like, basically, you have for most of the game, right? You have one good archer. I want to say, yeah, for most of the game, you have one good archer and it's all Christ. NTA is not great. And you get Fogato really late into the game. So having substitute archers to take care of like hot constant Wyvern and Griffin Rider um, reinforcements, especially since warriors have such high strength, they can basically um, one shot most uh, Wyvern, uh, Wyvern Riders by themselves. Compared to Alchrist, who has like 14 strength. And that with the bow is deadly and not in addition to this in it like there's even more right the extra layer is that if you give warriors longbows they can utilize uh backup way more effectively because now they have three range they can support people um so much better with chain attacks and that plus ike lol that's a great idea i love it because not only that, right? I also gave her a killer axe with uh, Lin's engraving. So, Hanet has a plus 50 killing edge, or killer axe, plus 10 from being hurt with her personal skill. But she has like a near 85% <laughs> chance to crit. Uh, and being a warrior also increases her uh, dex growth rate compared to being a berserker. But I have to say that I'm a little disappointed with that I had to make her change out of her original costume. Because I really liked her dress as a wizard. Um, but having to switch over to warrior and you lose your armor, or you, you make Panette lose her dress, I'm a, it's a little unfortunate. You have Ike plus Louis and you great ether physical enemies. True. Ike is good. Ike is really nice. Um, I think Panette is better. She is hilariously slow. Yeah, but Warrior will help fix that. But I agree. She is hilariously slow. But if she kills everything in one hit, then it's okay that she's slow. <laughs> Plus, it's not like she's going to be dodging anything at all, especially with, with uh, Lagu's friend. She can't get doubled if the enemy is dead. You're right. You're 100% right, Figu. Okay. Uh... Sleepy, thank you for patting Bruno.
been over an hour. It's been almost an hour, and we still haven't done any missions. Let's get started. Do you think the Pepsi hair and the character designs are neat, even though you heard the story's kind of nonsense? The beginning of the game, the story is pretty nonsense. But I think it starts to build up about uh, a quarter of the way into the game, which honestly isn't that bad. It's basically still a tutorial up in that. But then they definitely... The, the story is beginning to turn around, I would say. He gave Boucher on a killer axe of Lucina's engraving and him have and have him enemy phase with it. This game is so much fun to toy around. There's so much experimentation you can do. Alright, guys. Should I do... Ike Paralogue or Byleth Paralogue? Advanced level 5. I could probably do that. I'm at advanced level. Don't do Ikes. But it says advanced level 3. It should be easy, right? It shouldn't be that bad. Isn't it? It isn't like 3H experimentation either. It's fun and low investment. I agree. I I don't really like three houses in retrospect. <laughs> Austin, just because you told me not to do it, I'm going to go do it. Oh, wait. I said I was going to make food. So let's go make food. If you're going to do a parallel like you have to dip. I mean, what chapter are you on, Epsit? Because... I'm going to be doing chapter 15 soon, and I don't know if that's ahead of you. You're further in the plot than me, but you're dragging the parallels. Oh, okay. Decided to stop by, huh? Huh, I don't think I trust Alfred to cook me food. He's probably just going to make me protein powder. Alright. Alright. I can't make white sausage. A print. Oh, you also like white sauce. Can you make, dude? Excuse me? Sweet Dongo. Okay. And cream croquette <laughs> filled with white sauce. I see. Wait, who doesn't like Annette? You don't like the, uh... You don't like it. Okay. Okay, you like the cream croquette. Let's try it. Might as well make this part of my training routine. Oh boy, let's see. I think it's going well. Oh, look how good it turned out. Hey. Who doesn't like white creamy thick sauce in your mouth? I mean, it might burn your tongue though. Oh, A rank. I'll take it. Thank you, Alfred. I guess you can cook. Actually, I don't even use any more Farinese people. <laughs> Whoops. You do need to go have some dinner and do the rest of your tasks for the day. I'm going to leave a lurk and stuff done. Thank you for the raid and episode. I'm happy you entrusted your viewers to me. You take care. Good luck with your errands and happy. Thanks, Save, for the stream and being a great place you can send my people. You are very welcome. Where are we? Gebel Castle. 
At least that's what it looks like. Some place you've been? Yeah. It's near the border between the nations of Crimea and Galia. Interesting that this place is where we'll have our trial. Trial? I'm reading Warrior Cats right now and it's addicting. I don't have money for the next book, but I'll save up enough before I finish this one. Good luck, sleepy. We were pursued here by forces from the Kingdom of Dayan. They laid siege, trapping us. Our escape was cut off. The strength of their forces was overwhelming. My father had died. And I'd taken up his real no! And this is where I met my first great trial. That sounds rough. What did you do? <laughs> Alirian's like, oh, your father died? That's tough. That's rough, buddy. I fought to protect my sister and the Grail mercenaries. If you found yourself in the same situation, what would you do? I'd like to think I would also fight. I don't want anyone I care about to be harmed. And I believe you would fight well. So show me how you would defend those near to you. No words now, only deeds. A trial? You want me to fight you? If you win this fight, our bond will become even stronger. Understood. I won't lose. That's the spirit. Now, let's begin. These paralogues don't add a whole lot of story. They're more, I mean, functionally. These stories exist just to uh, increase the maximum level on your uh, emblem rings up to level 20, which is the cap. Uh, but as far as plot, it really just is kind of fan service because it presents you a map which is heavily inspired by the game that these characters came from. So this map is heavily inspired by, you know, a uh, a Path of Radiance map. I don't remember the exact one since I never played Path of Radiance. Oh god, he fucking moves. <laughs> and he has Ragnell! Shit. <laughs> this is scary. You remember this map? Oh. It was night in green. They have a lot of health. There's a lot of armored units too. And it doesn't look like anyone is slowed down by any of their weapons. Oh, they're using steel weapons. I guess that explains it. He's going to be tough to take down for sure. 25 defense. Oh, he has armor though. So I can use a hammer on him. I didn't listen. It's okay. I'll figure it out. Also, it was not very ruined. You had to protect the spot your MC is on. Interesting. Ubiki, I didn't know you played Rady uh, Path of Rain. Still very a lot to learn from you, cousin. Okay, question though. Are there any flyers? I don't see any flyers. Oh, these walls are... Why are these walls impassable to flyers? You guys are flyers. You fly over the wall. Excuse me? Also, this wall is destructible. That's not good. Pika! Thank you for the posture check and hydrate. Everyone, please take a sip of water and check your posture. Nintendo, explain! <laughs> explain the flaws! You want small live on it, Bruno? You got There you go. How you doing, Hika? Alright, uh, let's actually take a look at my map. It was my first Fire Emblem game. You played it twice, finished a normal run, and an Ike only. Nice! I'll have to play Path of Radiance one day. But I don't own Path of Radiance. I'll have to play uh, Radiant Dawn first. You're good, just waiting for your shift to start in seven minutes. Ah, oh, gotcha, gotcha. Good luck with work, Hika. Don't work too hard. This one was the hardest mission on an Ike only run? Yeah, I suspect so, since you had to, d to defend a single spot. Oh, 
Also, Path is the first game, Dawn is the second, yes. Did I mix them up? I didn't mean to mix them up. Hmm. Do I bring Panette? I guess I'll bring Panette because she needs to level. Bringing Boucheron would be really nice though because he actually has the speed to double a lot of these. Plus he can have... Oh, but I need a hammer. Hammers are good. Hmm. Then you can start your vacation. Excellent, Hika. Hope you get plenty of rest on your vacation. Hmm, I really want to bring Boucher on. But I really should level up and up. I guess this is okay. I'll just deal with this. I have enough tank characters, though. Actually... Uh, is Panetta tank character not really, kind of? Not exactly. Question mark. I need at least three tank characters. Let's actually take a second look. I don't think anyone can double her. Yeah, mo uh, the Swordmaster definitely can. Oh, that's going to be a scary Swordmaster. I think that's it. Just the Swordmaster. My advice for this chapter is to pick a god and pray. I think I'll be fine. I'm usually pretty good at these. I should make more bond rings now that I have Byleth. Can we pick two? <laughs> yes, pick two gods, any gods. Oh yeah, and I guess Chloe is technically a tank. Supposed to be a tank. Bond ring do you have that gives you plus two? Oh, it's one of the uh, birdies. Pick Hades and Ape. I'm not a god, Fubiki. If you're, if I'm a god, that makes you a god, because we're cousins. Good luck with Rekika. Do divine dragons count as gods? Technically, they do, because everyone thinks I'm a deity. I mean, Ivy is a huge simp. She literally said, I love you. would take up being a god. Alright, you're gonna be good. Dodge tank. But down here. Should really give you a hammer. Pray to Abe and Fubuki if you can blame them or the two yourself. Wow! Wow! Sword down there. X over here. Until this guy shows up. And I don't mind the lamp. I guess, Panette, you can kind of Hang back. Let Kagetsu get more of these kills. Okay. I should probably attack from the right side because I feel like that's the 
most defensible. Start pushing everyone towards the right. Rip Abe, I'll bring you flowers. What do you mean? I'm good at this game, guys. I promise. Let me check out their inventories, actually, because I think some people... Boots! Who do I give the boots to? Guess I can think about it later. Oh, I thought I upgraded your fire tone. You don't need Worm Slayer, because there, there are no worms. Actually, I guess I can give you to uh, I'll get to because you're not using anything else. All the boots to Anna. I benched Anna. She's not even here. And? <laughs> what do you mean, and? So there. Aaron and Ron are benched. And that you can use the hammer, but I don't think you're going to use it too well. It's nice to have, just in a pinch. We can see like that's an issue. It is an issue. More people had a... Uh... Oh no, I took away that because we attacked the palace. Hey, if I played 14 main series FE games and I struggled this one, I mean, I went blind, but still. And then I guess use it? And it's like level 6 right now. There's not enough arena matches in the world to get her back up to this level. I mean, there probably is, but I don't want to. Austin, believe in me. We'll be fine. As long as you don't get hit by that, I'll be okay. No, I get it. Once you stop investing in a character, that becomes extremely hard to get them back. I don't think Austin believes in me, guys. I feel hurt. I feel so hurt. Give me your best. Thank you for fighting Bruno. With elegance. Really, I want to care. I'm more concerned about people. Oh my god. Okay, maybe I'll go this way instead. <laughs> These ones aren't as scary. Much deeper. Thirty. You have just lances, right? Not spears. Oh, you do have spears. Fuck. Um. How strong is Fensilier? But I need to use that instead. 38. Your steward's ready. I'll protect you. Okay. Um hit me. Oh, you can hit me. That's awkward. I believe in you half as much as Austin. Yes.
I will obey. Thumbs. Understood. Ow, rude. Oh, I forgot to bring Hortensia. Whoops. Lame. It's okay. Where'd you get that clear on uh, Chloe, Abe? You get it from, um... Uh, redeeming the, uh, Fire Emblem Heroes item code. Entering it into the item shop. It's free. You get uh, three weapons, Alphonse, Serena, and Anna's weapons, uh, and you also get their uh, bond rings as well. Do I trust this? Probably, right? Steal it. Steal it. So you have 30 armor. Go ahead and use Slayer on you. Excuse me. Team, what is higher speed? Oh, uh, neither of you will do it. I mean, actually, no, you'll be. F I think you'll be fine. 21. Oh, they're both gonna hit me. I guess that's fine. Question mark. Unless I want you to do it. I'm not going to do that much damage. It'll probably hurt a shit ton. Man. And he's probably going to get hit by both of these. That's going to do what? 12? 11 damage? This will deal...
he'll be fine. Effectively has 15 defense. This will do 18. He should survive. I wish I had Kanto. So sad. Sure. Uh. It's two AM for you? Do you usually stay up at two AM, sleepy? And I guess that explains why you're always sleepy, huh? Only you had to hear the cancer earlier. I know! I was so sad! You made a grave mistake. Wait a minute. Hold, hold, hold up. Why do both of these guys only have 69 hit? What the fuck? Aeus knows what they're doing. Are you sure about that? Serves you right. Hmm... Somehow I doubt that. <laughs> you might pull an all-nighter, but you got school and PE tomorrow? You should probably head to bed then soon. They have a lot of health. Oh, they're breaking down the door. Ouch. I'm, I'm sorry. He's gonna slap me in the face. Oh, assuming he hits. Nice job. Oh, a chain guard. Bruno deserves all the pats. Bruno does deserve all the pats. Oh, 
Oh, the first hit gets chain guarded. Okay. Not the second. Use them with 30 HP. Under. Shame. Probably gonna break through this. Hey, why don't you use LNR to change weapons in Battle Forecast? I'm just lazy. I'm used to old habits where I don't get to do that. <laughs> I guess it's not because I'm lazy, it's because I have poor habits. Crit, 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 crit! No, you're supposed to crit. I have it. I don't play nice. That is that. That was totally unnecessary, but thank you. Please get speed. Please get speed. No. <laughs> He needs speed! I need to get her 2,000 SP so she can get speed taker. Otherwise, she's not going to double anyone. Alright, so I said I was going to try and move up this way, but I'm having more luck going south. Now I'm kind of in a claustrophobic uh, position. Just a scratch. Surprised how uh, much defense these guys have. Do you have? I can double you. Yeah, that's 24 damage each, so that's not going to kill you, though. They have so much bulk. Gonna kill this guy though. We'll fire you. Name. I knew I should have. Boosted your fire book. Imagine being awake at 2am and still didn't finish homework. Oh no, sleepy! That stuff's important. Just do it in school? Okay. As long as you can manage. You're in Ireland, and apparently homework will be banned. That's interesting. Never heard of that. Oh, please don't tell me you have an omen. L Thunder, thirty-four. Uh, it'll hurt, but it won't kill. I'm okay with that.
So I have to use Pendreo. The president in Ireland is amazing. Nice. Time to pray. Yay, you can finally heal yourself. Right. Do what I've been waiting for. Oh, really? Hmm. I meant to stick you right there, but... My plans are faltering. You literally are missing one damage. One single point of damage to killing this bird. Uh, okay. Guess I have to use you. For some reason, I have a lot of guy friends, and I normally get bored and mess with makeup, and I might ask them, hey, lipstick or lip gloss. And you're asking the wrong person. They're not used to it, but maybe if you could teach them the difference... I build an answer more effectively. So maybe they're the wrong person now, but if you teach them, they'll know them in the future. It'll always be useful. It'll definitely be useful knowledge for them in the future. That is a good level up. Thank you, all, Chris. Sorry. I won't forget you. Hmm. Can I kill you with a javelin? <laughs> I can. Okay. Oh, why did I do that? It's an elf undertone. Thank you for a wonderful level up, Chloe. Lip gloss makes your lip glossy and kind of shiny. Lipstick is just paint for your lips that can make them different colors or same shape. I don't know why, though. Uh, sometimes a different color makes them look nice. Or maybe it'll be a, a different shade of color, especially if you use foundation. So if you use foundation, it'll change the shade of your skin. And sometimes you want to, uh, that also means you will want to change the color of your lips as well. Just to match it better. If he breaks this wall down, then everyone's going to be flooding in. Axie, thank you for the lurk. Stand here. Oh, on fragments, I need you to get experience. Don't hit, please don't hit, please don't hit, please don't hit, please don't hit. Please don't hit. Thank you. Can you make your nose look broken with makeup? You can't. Be really nice to take your elf under tome, though. Plenty of damage. I think if I had. Oh, that's reinforcements. Oh boy. Uh, back up. <laughs> That's not good. Yowza, hello! 
that's unfortunate. I need Kagetsu to be able to get out of here. I think the best way to do that is place him right here so that they can get around. We will attack him a bunch though. This has to do his best to dodge everything. I don't think he can die in one hit. This group is trouble. Alright, this changes everything. Fire, spear. Yeah, you gotta go back and help them out. Ranos can keep pushing forward. two types of lip gloss and it's pink and white now uh the one that looks white is you're good and just fade and pick one is white when i'm done i think it's because of um it's just like the lighting right it'll just reflect and it'll make it appear white ow One experience point away, damn it. Well, Thunder is super good. Go ahead and just get that off. Stuff. Let's be careful. Sorry. Just random dual attack. You were beautiful while you lasted. Kill them eventually. <laughs> oh, my God, you're too slow. you're still better off standing right where you are. That only do all damage. Spear will do 31 16. Won't do It'll fucking hurt for sure. Stand right if you one try this, I'll be seriously worried about how underpowered your units are. What makes it more edible than normal lip gloss? Yeah, I thought... Wouldn't it be safe otherwise? Because if it's going in the lips, I mean, people lick their lips all the time. Of course, you shouldn't be, like, you know, like, chomping it off, because that might actually upset your stomach, but I don't know if it would actually... Uh... Damage would be took... Wouldn't kill you. It would be gross, but you'd be fine, right? I'm pretty sure they would. Okay. Do that. Stand right here. Please don't die, Kagetsu. Ow. 
dude. Oh wow, they actually avoided Kagetsu, which is good. Alright, crit chance now. Owie. Hold nothing back. See. If I heal you, would it be a full heal? It would not. What? Got to be shitting me. This is indeed on hard mode. Since I have, he has one health. Retribution is due. Hmm. Just the most damage. Wondering who can actually deal enough damage to kill this guy in one hit. I think it's Ivy. Twenty nine each. Okay. I need to kill the this little mage first. Uh, 
9 damage. What damage do you do? Come on, guys. You have a story about getting kicked by a donkey? You're okay, Wei? I'm glad to hear that. That sounds painful. Oh my god, you're literally one speed away from it. You're okay, just very stupid? No. Hmm. Okay, if I just dunk on everyone, this will work. I'm just overcomplicating this. First hit gets blocked. Uh, one. Good. Rude. I don't play nice. Hmm. I do these guys. Can I have ranged? I catch up before. Or I don't get surrounded. Good, good. Rest in pieces. Oh. All right, this is fine. Getting a little bit scary. I'm too spread apart right now. I hear I can you. Beat this. Thank you for alacrity. Were the other two waves in the reinforcements and playing on hard mode plus? I'm actually mad. I mean, so far there's been in reinforcements on the bottom and on the top.
I think now's a good time to... What does Thursus do again? Uh, grants magic range plus two. Eighteen damage, not that much more. There's supposed to be reinforcements on the left and right before the top reinforcements you played. I think it's because I triggered Ike a lot sooner. So the top reinforcements only spawned because um because I, I triggered Ike's aggro. So maybe that's what stops the reinforcements often. Anne is in danger, though. I'm hoping uh, one of these guys goes and attacks Ivy. I hope they don't both attack Ivy. 15, 15. Oh, no, she might die. Fuck. Uh... There you go. <laughs> now she's fine. I should retreat. And that should be fine. She's not in kill range. So, yeah, she won't she won't die to these guys. Whoa! Hello? Excuse me? What was that doing there? Uh <laughs> Holy shit! Oh, there's your reinforcements. Okay, this is actually very tricky. I need to think now. It's your range. What's the risk you'll hit me? You hit me, it's only 9 damage. Let's see. Ooh, now imagine this with more enemies. That's what I dealt with, totally not pouting. I mean, there's reinforcements right here, bow reinforcements, and that's not ideal. Have a good night, Sleepy. That's a lot of units coming down. I need to make it to the south side for sure. I get to you. You might have. You might be on your own for a while.
If you get hit, you are going to die. I don't have a good way to heal you. I don't have a physics staff. Oh, actually... Two, three, four, five, six. Okay, if I place you right here, Pendreo... You're out of range of this guy. You might get hit by him, but that's perfectly fine. You might even heal him. Oh, wait. Yes, you can kill him. So, I'm going to heal you. Uh, heal. Have you rope around so you don't get attacked by two groups. Just one group. Hopefully there's not more reinforcements on the right side. I mean, it ends if I can kill Ike. I think that's what I need to do. I need to kill Ike. But that's not going to be easy because he has fucking 50 defense. Especially since he has Wrath. And Ragnell is scary. I have to be very, very careful. Two, three, five, six. You get hit by one, that's not bad. No, wait, this might be bad. No, it'll be fine. He only does 9 11 damage. He'll be okay. Talk about a good time. Does he not give any reinforcements? I mean, if EXP? I guess not. Yeah, they have this thing called Void Curse. Shame. Thank you for alacrity. For Thank you for speed taker. Okay. Do forty damage? Not quite. Close.
I'm ready. Bonnet shield will definitely help here. I need to be able to kill him, like, this round. Okay, this isn't bad. Very nice. But you didn't bring pilot? I did. I gave it on Pandrea. All right, everyone in range? Fuck, oh, I guess he's not in range. That's okay. It's wrecked now, right? Almost enough. Oh wait, no, 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 I have a plan, 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 I have a plan. I have a plan, I have a plan guys. Uh... Please hit, please hit, please, please hit, please hit. Who has? No one has support on you. That's okay. Please hit this. She gets straight. Allow me to demonstrate. Oh my gosh, you do no damage! There you go, Austin! Mission complete! First try, let's go! <laughs> yes! Thank, thank you, Ivy, for doing 52 damage in one turn! <laughs> let's go! Myra, hello! Welcome, welcome. <laughs> retain the trial well. That was pretty scary. I mean, I, I I figured it out. I solved it. We didn't actually get to see Ike attack at all. 
<laughs> Alacrity is too strong. You should know that going forward, the fighting is going to get more intense. It's important to remember that you're a leader, and you must not give in to the pressure. Thank you, thank you. In this war, there can be no retreat. I was not expecting Ike to just fucking demolish an entire temple. An entire fort all by himself. You're right. He was just like, oh, you're hiding behind this wall? Crush. <laughs> Not anymore. <laughs> but I worry that fighting this hard may be too much for everyone. Or... Abby wasn't even fast enough for Alacrity. I mean, it's because I kept feeding her kills from uh, Speed Taker. She killed like four knights on her own, which gave her an extra eight speed. People who need your help. Don't worry. You're more than capable. I think Ike only has 15 speed. So you only need 20 to double. And when it seems your spirit might Did you not give Ivy Lynn? You forge that will win the day. I'll hold your words in my heart. Don't worry. If it looks like you've forgotten it, I'll be there to remind you. You'll be by my side? Always? Always. Thank you, Ike. I'm glad to know you're here with me. Oh, you did? Okay. Lynn also gives bonus speed. She, like, that Ivy kind of needs. And of course, um... What's it called? The, uh... The extra dex that I, uh... Um, we did it! First try! Woohoo! I think Bylas is even scarier, so I'm not do. Ah. Ape too good. Thank you, Neko. Thank you. Ape, remember when I said I've been getting bad level ups? Maybe. Kitty, I can't pick up the cat. No. It's such a cute kitty. Spicy. No, you have to. So in order to. How do I explain? Basically, regions have levels. Um, but the only way to rank up your region is by donating money to that region. And when you donate money to it, they'll teach you how to uh, take care of their respective animals. Um, so currently, Brodia is level 1 because I didn't want to give them any money. But at the same time, you have to be at least rank 2 to recruit cats. And I can't pick up this eagle either. You want to do another playthrough on Hard Out of Spite? Austin, do another playthrough on Maddening. Bribes to look the other way when you kidnap these animals. Yes. Get it. Absolutely get it. Austin, if you play in Maddening, you can't be stat screwed because everyone has fixed growths. Now then. Oh, wow. Ah, divine one. Just the dragon I was hoping to see. I could use a favor. Oh? What kind of favor? I'm hosting a party soon, and I'd like for you to be there. At our church, you're the center of our everything. Our deity. I think your attendance would really raise everyone's spirits. Hmm. Tell me more about this party. What is it going to be like? Oh, nothing formal. Just an occasion to sing, dance, and have a good time. You can blow off some steam and lend an ear to the other guests. Hear their stories. That sounds fun, but... 
What does my listening to people have to do with anything? Don't you see? It would be incredibly encouraging to everyone. The first time I saw you with my own eyes was like... <laughs> like seeing the light. Maybe if your hair wasn't covering your eyes, you'd see more of it. <laughs> You're coming on a little strong. <clears throat> Excuse me. Got a little intense there, didn't I? Anyway, it's short notice, so there's no need to let me know right away. But I'll tell you, I don't throw so-so parties. If I'm hosting it, you know it'll be a blowout. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. Thank you, Divine One. This guy just wants the cred for bringing a god to their party. Steel, silver, steel. Rare fruit. Rare fruit right next to the poop. I wonder if we're even going to have enough time to start. We probably won't have time to do Violet's Paralogue, but we can probably do... Um... The next God! chapter. That was incredible! Yes, learn to strike with that much force, and you are sure to trounce all comers. In truth, I was rather surprised when you asked me for lessons in brawling. I take it you wish to give someone a forceful talking to? A debtor, perhaps? Talks interestingly. Uh, what? No, nothing like that. I figured that I could lose my weapon when I'm in battle. Or get ambushed when I'm not. Just in case, it's best I learn how to hold my own in physical combat. I see. That is quite shrewd, Divine One. Very well. I shall instruct you in the ancient art of the fisticuffs. Fisticuffs. How to hone an indomitable spirit. How to repel foes with a mere scowl. There is much I can teach you. I see. Well, I'm ready to learn. She's a berserker, though. She doesn't use her fists. Into the most fearsome of scrappers. Let us begin. I say. Ah, yes. Any new items? Oh, In interesting. Feel free to come again. Uh, okay. Dang, thank you for patting Bruno. Saw me. Is it because I haven't played in a couple of days? Thanks for the community hydrate. Everyone, please take a sip of water. I'm doing pretty good thing. Go play some gotcha. Oh wait, I have to go put uh Annette, put Ike's ring back on. Ike! Leave it to me.
Um... I think it's funny that Fram has a higher rating than A. That's very impressive. Oh, he does. Sheesh. to my lance characters. I feel like I've retired most of my lance characters. I guess I have Tamira. I know I just turned her into a picket, but I don't really like. <laughs> I'm tempted to turn her into a. She loses a lot of stats, though. It's hard. Maybe I'll just keep her. Like, she's only doing a lot of damage because of the Pencilier. Otherwise, she doesn't, like, have a whole lot of strength. She's not exactly great against, uh... to give you the spirit. I need to do more damage with the Radiant Bow. How are you doing, Fang? That you need like 300 more SP and you'll be able to get Speed Taker. Excellent, because you desperately need it. I think Panette with Speed Breaker will definitely fix her. She has really low speed, but if she keeps killing stuff on the map, then. Doubling. Fortunate that the hammer weighs so much, she can't really use it effectively. Thunder. I 
to get the elf thunder. And no, maybe. Typically, I want Fram next to here. Also, I need to start leveling up Hortensia. Don't know who to bench for Hortensia. Hard, because like Fram's very strong. Like, kind of falling off. Well, no, I don't want to say she's falling off, but she's like, her stat spreads is amazing. Andrea, I think, is just a better Fram. Like, more HP, less defense, but more res. Uh, similar speed. It's a lot less magic, but he has more dex, which will make him hit harder. I wonder, if I swapped you to a sage instead of a... So what would that do to you? You lose S on... As, but you gain S on books. Trying to get rid of Fram? I don't want to get rid of Fram. It might happen. Less strength, which is fine. Uh, less luck. Less res, but you get one more speed. Unit initiates attack combat with a tome. Grants attack equal to the number of adjacent allies. Oh... This isn't bad, actually. Hmm. This is promising. Very promising. I have to think about this. Because I almost feel like Bram might be even better as a sage. Or build, which will help a ton, because she's wait her thing is way too much. Um more speed, less luck. They're definitely comparable. I think she might benefit more from Hmm. Hard to say. Very hard to say. I don't know. Well, I guess spell harmony is what, just one more damage per mage? And it's just I have one, two, three, four. If potentially four people. Four mages on me. Mayra might bench. Bring in Hortense. <laughs> they have so many healers. Not enough tanks. I guess Panek can be a more of a fighter though. He has the bulk though. Push her on. Yeah. I wouldn't say that Boucheron and Panette are great tanks, but they can definitely take a few hits of their own. They just need to make sure they're 
constantly healed. Which I guess is the benefit of having so many healers, right? Even though Panette and Boucher aren't taking so much damage, at least eight people. Tamera, I feel like, doesn't really bring too much to my party. The advances are not amazing. Either is her strength 15? Like, she has less strength than most of my party. So maybe I bench Tamera and bring in Hortensia. I think I like that idea. Let's forget what Hortensia learns. Uh, World Tree. Oh yeah, that's right. Whenever she casts a spell, it might not take staff. Okay, I'm okay with that. Four healers for... A third of my team will be a healer slash... That's fine. Which then brings the question... High Priest Sage. I think Pendreo can stay as a high priest. Bram would do more damage as a sage. I think that's okay. I think what she needs is the higher build and higher damage, so she isn't slowed down so much. Otherwise... She's going to be stuck uh, with a fire tone for the rest of the game. Jism. So I need to buy a second seal. Welcome. I thank you. 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 Do come again. Actually, how much exp I think Graham was actually close to leveling. Okay, so we'll give her one arena win, and then we'll change her class. And who do I give the Elf Thunder to? I guess I can give it to Fram. Not that it'll stay in Elf Thunder. I want to turn this into a... Uh... Andreo can't use can only use L-Thunder. So it'll be Ivy or... Ram might be the most beneficial because Ivy has a lot of speed. She'll be using the L-Fire Tome more often. That makes sense. Fine. Well, Thunder. Turn this into... Oh, I need steel! I could buy the steel. Let's just buy the steel. I'll be here. I say? 
We're going to keep Fram a little bit longer. Oh, you have to buy it one at a time? Thanks for shopping. Thanks for shopping. Feel free to come again. I'll have to try and sell mm. some of the extra stock later. Yeah. What does Eyeless Emblem? Academy makes it. Uh. Oh wait, no. Should. Hmm. I want to. Oh. See, makes it way more, but more hit chance, dodge, and. Okay, so this is pretty decent for an axe. Wonder. I'd say this is a good alternative to Lin's uh, engraving if you can handle the weight. Unfortunately, Pan cannot handle this weight. I think this on no tune is not a bad idea. Especially since the hit chance is so low. I think. No, uh, Boucheron's the only one who can actually handle the extra. I don't even think all Chris I'll can handle. Here. Well, Chris is a uh, yeah. That would put it at nine, right? Yeah, that would put it at nine, so you'd be slowed down by it. Really, the only person that can kill. Even Chloe is slowed down by the. I'm not using Tamara. I guess I can. Dang, where'd all my lancers go? I had so many, and now I have like none. <laughs> I guess we'll put it on Noah too for now. I can always change it later. Higher hit chance is always good. Hmm. Where is the elf? Auron! Plus one silver. Good. I'll be here. Items. Store this. The Thoron Temple. I 
Chemistry and magic is pretty low. Put this away. Her strength is kind of pitiful. <laughs> Go ahead and help with the physics staff. Let's heal staffs. Just two people. People have heal staffs. So we'll use up the rest of the heal staffs and switch everyone over to. I think everyone has starting to have way too much HP. Who do I give these levels to? Who's closest to leveling? I guess I need to give it to Fug Um. Probably Fogato. Fogato probably needs it the most. Thank you for patting Bruno. If you... Just this. Although I'll be making some more implements. No, thank you for allowing us to, you to pack Bruno. It is an honor to pack Bruno. I guess that means the same thing. But Bruno's not my cat. But I'm sure Loki hey. would love to let you. Ah, oh, that's a lot of gacha currency. Oh. Should I really be here? Goodbye, John. It's been an honor sparring with you. I I did it! I won! Good job. Not bad. Gato here, captain of the Sentinels. Better be ready. I challenge you. Face my iron wall. Oh, you're done for. This isn't funny enough to write about. That was fun. Thanks. More. I'm Fogata, Psalm's very own prince. I am Pedreo. Oh no. Oops. This is a bad matchup. <laughs> You're strong. I can learn a lot from you. Dang. So close. Cute. I can't even handle it. Oh, and that red skull. 
skirt is really chic. Oh no, this place has accessories too. Well, goodbye, money. It was nice knowing you. Tell me about it. I have to stop myself from snapping up everything in the store. Princess Samara, what are you doing here? Shopping? Why, is that weird? Oh, uh, no. I just would have assumed you had people to do that for you. I like to go shopping on my own. Incognito. Actually went off stream to cool off to continue to play Monopoly on Switch, got kirked on through checking on your IV. Has 21 base speed at level 15 promoted. Oh no. Wow, I love that. It's almost like you're a real person. It's almost like you're a real person. <laughs> Thanks, I think. Gotta say, Fram, you've got style. Your color scheme is elegant, yet I can't. He's going terribly. Don't get me started on that skirt. It's completely unequivocally you. You really think so? I'm honored. I spent a long time on this look. Took me a while to nail down the right ensemble. Trust me, I know the feeling. It's hard to find a perfect balance. You'll make it, Austin. I believe in you. Exactly. I want something that's both practical and cute as heck. Is that so much to ask? <laughs> You're speaking my language. I can't believe I'm talking fashion with Princess Tamara. It's like a dream come true. Hey, I've got an idea. Why don't you pick out clothes for me sometime? Really? 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 And I'll pick some. Got hit by 26% aid help me more. Oh, I can't help you there. That happens to all of us. I got hit by a 3% once. Did you need something from me, Panette? Oh, no. Why do you ask? You have been staring at me for some time. It's just that for a princess, you seem so... Uh, how to put this? Composed. Do I? It seems like a rather ordinary level of composure to me. Really? But you're not bursting into song or dancing to and fro. Correct. I do not do those things. Nor are you running around like a mad wolf or cramming prime rib down your gullet. You are simply standing around. It was so odd, I could not help but stare. Perhaps you are merely unaccustomed to the standard and expected conduct of royalty. I have offended you, haven't I? My deepest apologies. No, no need for that. I should not be looking for offense in others' customs. It's rather nice to speak with you, actually. My own retainers lack a certain... Explain what bowl of soup means in this context, Eve. I had a nice bowl of soup before I started this stream. I was full of soup. Really? I enjoy your company as well. Good. Then, if it's all right with you, I'd like it very much if we became friends. Of course, your highness. It would be my honor. I really like Pennett's design. And like, despite being you know, someone who enjoys I am suit, I guess I am part suit. Pandreo, I am ready to make a confession. He hates parties. Okay, I'm ready. Why are they doing this in my bedroom? What Guys, wish to confess? get out of my bedroom. Have this conversation somewhere else. Please. Please. Why does it have to be here? But you see, I... I lied to my friend. To you. Did you get in there? Apparently the door is unlocked. Huh? It stays unlocked. Because everyone can go into my room and stare at a layer sleep. It's... The war. Andrea. I'm not sure we can win. Our enemies are, are getting stronger. I'm so worried for the future, I, I can barely sleep. The other day when I told you I was distracted because of the party? That was a lie. I just couldn't stop thinking about all the people who could die on my watch. Oh, buddy. I'm not 
happy-go-lucky guy you think I am. I know, it's my job to keep a smile on. I just... I'm so damn scared, Pendrail. I appreciate you telling me. <laughs> it's only after pulling the wool over your eyes. What do you mean, how'd they get in there? There's only one wall. <laughs> nah, don't flatter yourself. I saw right through it. You did? Of course. How gullible do you think I am? I can tell when my friend's feeling blue. I'm not a prince, so I won't pretend I can fix it. Or that I really know what you're feeling. But what I can do is promise that I'll always support you. As your retainer and your friend. So don't worry. Uh, let me rephrase that. Worry to your heart's content. I'll still be here. Damn, Pedreo's a real bro. Get yourself a homie like Prendrero. Because at the end of the day, that's all I can offer. Huh. That's strange. My vision's gone blurry. He's crying! Hey, hey, hey. Crying's not allowed, you hear? Because if you do, I'm gonna. <laughs> no, I'm not crying. Not quite, at least. I think this is the first A rank support I've gotten with anyone's. You know, this reminds me. It was during a confession you told me you were the prince. That's right. I used to go to your parents' church all the time. You and I were fast friends. And then you dropped that on me. <laughs> Easily one of my top five most interesting confessions. I almost forgot to breathe. I was so shocked. Well, you were looking for Panette. I had to tell you she'd become my sister's retainer. And if you didn't know I was the prince, you wouldn't have bought it. And the next thing you said was even more shocking. What's Pendreo's relation to Panette? Are they siblings? How's a job as my retainer sound? That's right. And as your retainer, I'm not just here for the highs, all right? I'm here for the lows, too. Whether you need a buddy on the dance floor or a shoulder to cry on, I can be that. Yeah, this is actually really sweet. Thank you, Pendreo. I gotta say... I'm gladder than ever that I was so honest in my confession back then. That was good. I like that. Okay, Pedrea, uh, we're probably going to find out. They're siblings, aren't they? I had no idea. I did not draw that connection. Hello, Pandreo. Have you a moment to spare? Of course. I always there we go. Sister. But first, you got to tone down the formality. Uh, all right. You see, there's something I've been meaning to ask you. Nope, nope. You're still speaking in that highfalutin way. Highfalutin? Guys, what's highfalutin? You don't really expect me to... Yes, I do. I know you Rootin, make tootin, to highfalutin. Fans, but come on. It's only me here. Oh, she's faking the accent. You can drop the silver spoon act around your own brother. <sighs> Fine. Why are you working for the church? That's what you wanted to know, huh? Dad was a drunk. Mom was a corrupt priest who couldn't be bothered to look after her kids. They were lousy parents. So why would you want to follow in their footsteps, serve their church? I told you what happened after you left, right? They disappeared. Uchi, why? Why do you have to reset the universe? Yeah, so? Well, the church's followers needed someone to guide them. That's why I stepped in. <laughs> so that's what it was. I know it's been a while, but if you'd like to come pray with us, you're always welcome. No, I think I'll pass. I'm done with our parents, and I'm done with their church. I'd sooner drop dead than step foot in that place again. Okay, I am very genuinely interested in this. Fair enough. Learning more about this. I'm, I am glad... The support conversations are just, like, simping for a leer. Because I was actually, like, very invested in this now. Ah, uh, that was just what I needed. It's been way too long since we rode together. Yes, boss. Nothing beats a nice jaunt on Wolfback. You and I used to go riding practically every night. What happened to those days? War happened. The world has changed. Unfortunately. Isn't that the truth? And you know, you've mellowed out a lot since those days. What do you mean by that? Oh, come on! Remember how we met? 
You had a bunch of bandits tied to trees and were about to feed them to the wolves. That was merely to intimidate them. I wasn't actually going to... And don't get me started on the way you used to talk. You'd say things like, Feeling hungry, punks? I've got a fresh serving of knuckles for you right here. <laughs> Why, I beg you to cease this coarse impression. <laughs> don't worry, Pennant. I love the old you. But I love the new you, too. The feeling is mutual, boss. Your relentless teasing aside. I'd have to say, Panette's probably one of the most interesting characters to have appeared so far. Hey, Jade. Got a sec? Certainly, Princess Tamara. What do you need? I hear that you're from a mining town, so you know a lot about minerals and stuff. That's right. My father was a gemologist, so I picked up a fair bit of knowledge. Perfect! Seeing as Her voice so sounds familiar, but I can't quite figure what it is. You're going mineral hunting? Yep. See, I'm on the hunt for a big, fabulous jewel to be. I already have a place in mind, but I'm not sure how to go about finding a gem there. Ah, I understand why you came to me. You? I wouldn't mind joining you, but if you're interested in jewels, why not visit a jeweler? You are royalty, after all. I'm sure they'd sell you as many rare stones as you want. Yeah, but that's no fun. I'd much rather find one for myself. You know, do it the old-fashioned way. I see. That's a rare perspective. Well, if that's the plan, I'll be happy to guide you. I'll take a few notes along the way. I might be able to mine some ideas for my next novel. Perfect! I get a dazzling jewel, and you get a dazzling protagonist. Win-win! Okay, um... That's it, right? Because I can't... I wonder if it's worthwhile just to boost everyone on levels. Might make things a little bit I can't think of any skill that they would need beforehand. Except maybe dual. I mean, you're at nine. So actually, I should do this now so that you're not maxed out at Getting them all to, ele to 11 is actually very strong. Makes them last one more. Rio, you might have to stick at 5 because I'm not doing Lila's chapter just yet. All it does is give you luck 6, so you're okay here. Rayo, what do you learn? More defense. You learn Irvin. Incredibly strong, but makes you very slow. Honestly, Ike would not be bad on Usheron instead. All this would do is get her a little bit more defense, I think. Resolve plus is not until eight. Then get everyone to eleven. Except for uh, I think that might be a. Then, uh, Fram, I'm gonna get reclassed to Sage.
the penalty is that Thor ends up this. Very good. Would be nice to get Sylphield. Looks like some more items to spawn, so we can grab those. We can put the forge, get some food, and start the next chapter. Egg. Very good egg. I think did I feed Sami? I feel like I did. Pretty sure I fit. Hmm. Mm, six steel, so I don't think I can do too much here. Which requires steel. I think I don't pretty strapped. I don't think I can upgrade. Uh that's okay. That's okay. I think I need to upgrade. here. Alright then, just food. Oh. Sorry, Alfred. Green Kanji. I'll do my best, but that's not saying much. Hey, have some Sorry confidence. I'm the one to use you ingredients. I'm ready to apologize if this isn't tasty. The flavor is invigorating. Probably like a D ring. It's tasty. Yeah, better than nothing. Wanted to boost everyone's.
preferences. Get everyone to bond level 10. I'll roll for some rings and then we'll get. Um, Ivy. Loose. Ivy, Crown Princess of Illusia. I am Lynn of the Lorca tribe. Yeah. Must be faster. Yeah. Ha. Yeah. Ha. Ow. Victory Ooh, lucky. <laughs> I still find it odd to fight alongside a family heirloom. Illusia's royal family has a... Oh, I guess it doesn't matter if I win or not, huh? Um... Let me think, what does having 11 mean? Uh, strong bond. You don't really need to have more. It's me, the Brodian prince who isn't Diamant. Lucina, princess of Elise, has arrived. I won't miss! I lost? I'm sorry. Are you hurt? Easy win. I was trained by my own father, just like you, Alchrist. Seems we have that in common. Thank you for the lurk, Watt. I'm not worthy of such a favorable... I am Alchrist, a prince of Brodia. I am Lucina. Let's see what you can do. I will protect everyone. I lost? Damn. I'm sorry. Are you hurt? That's good. Who else? Uh, not Pendrea. What? Rolling one on one is not for the weak of heart. I'm Ike. You've got no need to hold back. Let's have some fun. Next time for sure. I'm so sorry. Are you injured? Press it. You were in the service of the royal family. I imagine they were quite strict about etiquette. My friends told me I misstepped sometimes, but I never noticed any problem. <laughs> One more level, please. Oh, actually, Wrath is super nice. Brace yourself. I'm Ike of the Grail Mercenaries. Dang, no I'm crits. Sorry. Are you injured? Do I get Wrath on her? Wrath sounds fun. Let's do it. Let's get Wrath on her. Rolling one on one is not for the weak of heart. I'm Ike, a mercenary. Oh, it's harder now. Uh, you looking 
Okay, there we go. Next time for sure. I'm so sorry. Are you injured? Lucky. This will literally give her a hundred percent crit. Um, I think I'm ready now. Really can't do any more upgrades. Bye. So. All right, let's get the corn ring. Time to get corn. Whoa! Hello. Oh wait, no, I lied. I need to go do gotcha. How you doing, Velo? I didn't know the new fire emblem MC turns into a boat. Yeah. It's your special power in this game. You can transform into a boat. How you doing, Velo? Did you get to watch Alcor cook an egg today? Were you one of the taste testers? You're all right, God. Just trying to make it through the week, aren't we all? Tomorrow's what Wednesday, so we're almost halfway through. Oh, you couldn't have things to do? That's okay. I'll have to check out the VOD. I was really interested in it, but I had uh, to stay late, unfortunately. Like I always do. Eek egg, yes. Let's see. A uh, ring chamber. Who knows, Bella? You might get some leftovers. Leftover omelets, yum. <laughs> Tin is. Make it sparkle. Thanks again. See you next time. That area needs work. Did you clean that up? Good work. I'll ask for your help again. Oh, Chris, where are you? Sorry about the hassle. You're wasting time. What do you mean? How does it look? <laughs> you mean I'm wasting time? What does that mean? That should help. <sighs> what fine care you've taken. So weird listening to Violet talk. Gotcha time! Let's go! I want some S rank rings, please. No, I don't want these C rank stuff. No, no. What's with my gotcha like? So bad at this. Yo, S rank Raphael. He ranked Dimitri. Okay, it's turning around. Do one more. B Ferdy. B. B.
Dan. Well, we got one S rank ring. It's basically a copy of Lucas's ring. Sigh. Dimitri's ring, dude. Um, two HP, one strength, one death. Good. Would give that. That might be best on. Their Marin? Or. Probably Boosh. HP is ring. Yes, Marin. More strength and more. Wait, I'm confused. Why is Lucas's ring infinitely better? Two one two. This is 211. What the hell? What? Raphael, your ring sucks, dude. What the fuck? Excuse me? Raphael, please. Why does your ring suck? Imagine going up to someone engaged marriage and telling them that their ring sucks. Well, it's true. Their ring does suck. He didn't shrink. Dex. And it gives him that. The Theos isn't that. Might actually been. Guess I'll stick with that. Like Raphael's ring is actually objectively worse than that's crazy. <laughs> Imagine proposing to a mage with a physical spec ring. Embarrassing. <laughs> this is actually good. If I was able to get um, an S rank Dimitri, you get Paraceline, which after you attack someone that you're next to, you get to move a space back. That's crazy. <laughs>
Uh, there. <laughs> no A or S rank rank. How disappointing. Tempted to give Boucheron. He need more. He doesn't really need more. She definitely doesn't. I guess you don't need two more defense at 52 HP. Okay, I'd say we are close. See if there's someone who gives magic. It's like Cynthia. Strength, defense, 2 HP. I don't really anyone benefits from that. Strength, defense, 2. Yeah, not really. Hmm. Two HP is nice, but. I guess that's that. You might benefit. You have like no HP at all. And the attack is useless. At least it's a. Hmm. Hard to say. I turn all these into a C rank ring. speed and magic. This is actually pretty good. Hey, what do you get? Just Dex Magic Res. Uh. Buff me. Magic is in the muscles. Oh, I just realized I dropped a ton of frames. But how that happened? Guys, I wish my gotcha wasn't so shit. So I know how to make it not bad. Gotcha emblem, yeah. Even in this game, there's gotcha. Can't hide from it. Teaching us that life is gotcha and your ring sucks.
All right. Enough time wasting. Let's go. You gotta go rescue Corin. I think I'm terribly over level. No, not another night map. Please don't tell me it's not a night map. Nicely. Just a bit more practice and I'll call it a day. Who is this? And this spot, it's perfect for rehearsal. So quiet and empty. Uh oh. What is that? Oh god, I'm trapped here. Is it my fate to die like this? It's such a pity to be caught so unprepared. I'd have practiced combat as well as dance. Dancer! We get a dancer! Hurry! You must get to safety now! Who said that? Oh, thank goodness. You can hear what I'm saying, can't you? Follow the sound of my voice. You can hide in here. There's a door to your right. Now go! Hurry! I'm coming. <laughs> what was that? What kind of zombies are these? Is the Northern Fortress that frightening? It's your tasteful midriff. Yep. My ancestors designed it that way. Didn't want people to go poking around. Why they look at each other? They got in each other's way. Ghosts wander the ruins. It's like when two big people get stuck in a door chasing after someone. <laughs> Lately, some have heard a young woman's voice calling out from inside. <laughs> Relax, that's just the local lore. You've heard that before. Then why did you make it sound so real? Alir, you know exactly who it is. It's the ring. Mikaya did the same thing I've to Yanaka. I've never even been there. Mom always told me to stay away so nobody would figure out the ring's location. Looks like it's a rescue there mission. The Northern Fortress. Hmm. For an abandoned fortress, it's awfully noisy. Wouldn't they want a garrison in the Northern Fortress, considering Illusia's uh, been invading? Wait a sec. The Corrupted! They've gotten in! But I guess the desert itself is like one big uh, environmental obstacle. So I guess they wouldn't necessarily need a fortress, as long as they keep doing like Gorilla attacks on the Illusion army whenever they try to invade. Let's go. We can't let them get the ring. Then it seems like the corrupted can just spawn from anywhere, so maybe it's not super ideal to try and garrison them. Wouldn't be able to move. Oh no. Yeah, this place is swarming. Guess it is a little haunted, huh? Hang on. Divine one, look! There's someone here! They have us well and truly surrounded. Again. Still, safer inside than out in the open. Thank you, Ring. I was telling you to hide, not come looking for me. How could I stay away? A talking ring! You really set off those creatures as well. I take it you're a princess. Trapped in this unusual form by a wicked curse. Let me out. Actually, I'm... No need to persuade me, Your Highness. I'm not one to doubt an unusual story. Oh, spirit of the This guy's gods, name is Seedal. Cast your light upon the path before us. You're a fortune teller, hmm? What are your cards saying to you? Le Dragon. It means help may come from an unexpected source. I suppose we'll just have to hold off the beasts until it arrives. Unit selection, is it only nine? Shit. Alright, that's two characters I can't bring in. Let's take a look at the map. What do we need? No archers yet. Floor Miasma, Foe. Oh yeah, that's not good. <laughs> Plus 20 res? Excuse me? Basically, don't stand in this shit and make sure they don't stand in it either. Funny that they use compact axes. Uh, they have a good chance of hitting him. Guess you're a dancer, but you're also a chi adept. 
Carry stance. At start of turn, allies within two spaces of the unit recover 10 and Oh, it still heals them. Passive healing. Seventeen defense damage. Wondering who I send in there to kill everyone. <laughs> Maybe Panette. Have a layer stand right behind her. I guess that'll help reduce some of the damage. Uh, but I really want to bring Hortensia. She needs the EXP. I just can't really um, remove anyone from this team. I like really limiting my uh, options here. Eight all escapes, or either of us die. Have too many options here. Like removing Ivy is just like not a good in my opinion. Gato needs experience. I guess he's really hard to pass up on. They're all really hard to pass up on. They're all very good units. I can't fit one more. But Artensia is like going to be a really great mage to have. Not to mention flyers are always nice too. I feel like I have to bench all Chris for now. As much as I don't want to. You might actually get broken.
And everyone else just moves on. with this. I didn't check their items. The ring. I think he's trying to protect it. He's clearly no friend of the corrupted. Let's give him a hand. It looks like he could use one. Wonder. I mean, how hard is it to get him down here? Right? Or is he just gonna try and run away? Verily. Say the word. All right. Whatever you say. Give me strong foes. Shall we? No mistakes. Okay. Your heal staff. I want to level her up with this brain. Hundred and eleven crit damage. Let's have some fun. My goodness, how awful. Hungry for more. I'm sorry. Holy shit. All these critical hits. She's not even using a killing weapon. Another accident level up. Oh, some of these spaces are just walls. Stand next to them is what? Probably not even gonna hit her. Will 
not lose. How much did he have with that axe? Get some speed! Get some speed! Please! Oh, that's a shame. Okay, feel free to use that thunder. In range. Thanks. Divine dragon, you say? What do you know? My cards spoke true. Unexpected source indeed. Thank you. I am Seedal, a traveling dancer. From where? I mean, your garb is very Psalm. What are the people of Psalm called again? Psalmy? I was out Psalmian? there in when those creatures appeared. A talking ring called me to safety. A talking ring, hmm? Yes. I believe it's a young princess who fell victim to some sort of curse. Isn't that awful? Not a curse, exactly. You know her story, then. Tell me, who is this mysterious ring woman? Hand it to me, and we'll find out together. All right. Bear your fangs! Emblem of Fate! It's Corin, And she's not wearing pants! Is she barefoot in this game? I can't remember. She is barefoot in this game. I am Emblem Corin. I'll fight with all I have. Thank you for finding me. I'll help ensure the path you decide to walk is the right one. Thank you, Emblem Corin. I'm sorry I kept you waiting for so long. An emblem? Really? One of the godlike figures of legend. Seedal, would you fight by Corrin's side? We could use your help getting out of here. It would be my pleasure. This world, wonders upon wonders. Uh oh. Huh? Did those doors just? Go on the long way. We won't be able to escape the way we came in. Let's try that path over there.
was in such a rush earlier. I didn't notice the miasma all over the place. The creatures must have brought it with them. It certainly wasn't here before. Use my power to dispel the miasma and open a path for your allies. Or Emblem Corrin can restrict foes' movements and create terrain to control the flow of battle. Sync Dragon's uh, Sync Skill Dragon Bane adds terrain effects based on the user's unit type while clearing the same area of any flames or mana. Gauge Weapon Dual Katana, unlike most swords, is strong against lances. Uh, the Engage Skill Dreadful Aura prevents a target and foes adjacent to it from moving more from moving for one turn after the shade's gone. Gauge Attack Torrential Roar blasts foes in front of the three spaces, flooding the area terrain and clearing it up. Emblem, engage! Well, mages. The choice is yours. Oh, okay. <laughs> so it blocks the way, so I can't get through. Awkward. I guess it'll be a distraction. Divine one, as a dancer, I can raise your allies' spirits with my graceful movements. Please, call upon my abilities as you see fit. The lowest level here, you are. It's always good. I'm listening. Funny. All right, I guess I'm just going to crowd around here. Oh, it lasts for one turn. Okay. Straight up use the Moron and disintegrate. you to disintegrate uh no not and fram is just one movement away from it fortunately you're short like a ton of attack Uh, 
that's okay. He'll be fine. Um, I just kill one of you right now. I'll be fine. Yes. For the divine dragon. I think fifteen's the max they'll do though. Great. Oh, you're not gonna kill him. Oh no. Unfortunate. Of course. What else can we right? Needs more fire. Hey Elcor. How was the Egu? Sorry, Mr. Stream. That was a lot of egg. How many uh, taste testers were you able to bring? You're gonna turn into an egg? Oh no! We give up five omelets, family and family friends. Nice. How did it taste though? So three or four left after? Oh my god. Is it just like a regular chicken egg? Nothing too special about it then? Just very big? I'm curious what the nutrition is like. Would you say it's more nutritious? Or I guess that would require some research. Whether or not um, eggs are more nutritious. Maybe the ostrich egg yolk looked really rich? Oh. I want your elf under tome. Emu is pretty much a regular egg, I see. Very orangey yellow, some more nutrition in there. Orangey yellow reminds me of uh, like Japanese chicken eggs. I don't know if you've seen those before, Alcor. They're almost like a orangey red color. 
Ramen eggs are very golden yellow color. I won't miss a step. Still the men's staff. Always very cute and has pretty hair. I like her hair too. She's currently riding a giant lizard. She was originally a Pegasus Knight, uh, but I turned her into a fierce warrior instead. Um, Ivy's another one who's really cute. I like her a lot. A horse only dragons, yes. Literally, there's no one. I mean, there is one horse here. But this horse has ram horns, so it's kind of uh, it's a disguise. Horses cosplaying a sheep, exactly. Would you rather ride a Pegasus or a Wyvern? Uh, personally? That's a good question. I'm not 100% sure. All right, revealed. Not even close. I think wyverns are cool. Pegasus is Pegasi? Pegasus is Pegasus? I don't know. Uh, Pe Pegasus is are probably more docile? Question mark. I mean, I've never ridden a horse before. Hard to say. You know, dragons are cool. No, you healed her to full. Shame. Probably is a good idea. Fills into Dotto. The stage is mine. Dragon V. Here. 
slightly closer. Everyone just get slightly closer. can stay next to him. Rude. I'm sorry. Oh, I'm an idiot. The next guy is going to attack in melee range. Barely getting any, getting any EXE points. I'm sorry. Can't see. What was the most challenging part of the game for you so far? The early game. Uh, you don't really have access to a whole lot of tools at the very beginning. That makes it very difficult. I suspect it'll continue to be fairly difficult uh, when I go back and do uh, maddening mode. I mean, it's kind of like, you know, when you start out in playing Pokemon, right? You have access to a very limited number of moves and a very basic Pokemon. But once you get towards, like, the middle of the game where you start having a lot more variety, taking advantage of, like, weapon... Like, I wasn't going to say weapon types, but, like, you know, uh, move types... In Pokemon types, uh, it starts to become a lot easier if you know what you're doing. And the same case is in Fire Emblem as well. Where the early game, you have very basic units who don't have a lot of abilities. All their stats are very basic and low. You have to rely a lot more heavily on, you know, uh, careful planning and movement strategy, right? Because you just don't have a lot of other options other, uh, otherwise. But once you get to like this late in the game, where uh, you have you know a lot more tools in your box, and you can kind of, you, you you have a lot more freedom to kind of design your your team right and synergize around your team. And if you do that while also taking advantage of every bit of the game you can. Uh, It becomes a lot easier. So, like, right now, uh, I don't feel challenged by hard mode. It's kind of, like, silly, easy. Um, since that's the case, I want to... Right here. Uh, try and get through this part as quickly as possible. And then I can uh, start on the, harder, the hardest difficulty of this game. Just move it. Very slowly move everyone up.
screwed. For the divine dragon. I'm kind of surprised that they're still giving me characters, though. I feel like we received most of the cast already. Uh, this sucks. Not impossible, but this sucks. Six damage. So close. Or for your Pokedex, for sure. Almost level two. <laughs> hey, treasure. It's always nice. Dang it. HP. Oh, that's a lot. I'm not worried. They're kind of weak. Oh my god. Literally survives with one HP. Yeah. Oh, you know what? No one would have done it. Actually, no, she's not level five. Never mind. Never mind. I don't think you're going to land this hit. You can try. <laughs> I've seen crazier things. Yay! There we go. Hit it. Excellent. So I want to stand in there. Alright, who's standing in there? Who's getting a face full of axe? I don't think anyone has an option besides Rio. May all find salvation. Is it? Grab that shot. Energy drop. Hell yeah. I don't know who to give it to, though. No one with really low strength. Someone with really high strength.
I can see he's kind of really low right now, too. That's such a cool character. What do I do? I'm actually right at the end. <laughs> Need a dancer friend. Oh uh, no, you're too far away. Still Lance. I can sense someone like, ah, uh, no. They're gonna stand in here, no one's gonna be. Actually, if I send a mage there. Like, no damage from L Surge. It's 20. 28. Uh, it'll do 20. At least it's home. Oh no, Hortensia is. Actually, it's the same. I know that or not. And right there, and hopefully you don't die. Very nice. Next to your sister. bad idea. Oh, wait, no, that would put you at zero, actually. We're fine. We'll be fine. Have your flame lance, please. No apologies. Damage. What do you mean? We're sweeping them.
Mm. This is awkward, because now they're, like, standing where I need to be. I guess. Avalon TV, thank you so much for the follow. Eden Art, how you doing? Oh, hello. That makes things incredibly awkward. Um. I can't really do any damage to them. There's more damage. We have Thoron. Nine hold. one <laughs> but they'll still get hit zero damage This I may as well. Oh, why is your Astra so weak? Oh, We're okay. Yeah. <laughs> we would be in trouble, but we're okay. Actually, do you guys have the void? I can't actually get experience from you, right? No, I can. Oh, they're kind of scary. It would be fun to kill. I mean, the issue here is that if they... Auto! 
Welcome! Good to see you again so soon. Ready Black Rose, welcome back. Good shout out, Otto. We're also playing Fire Emblem Engage. Excellent, excellent. Sounds like a comfy time. Comfy whales are always welcome here. We're currently on chapter 15. We have done Ike's Paralogue and started chapter 15. We're gonna take a break after this. You lost your rings? You're at that chapter? What did you think of chapter 10 and 11? You don't like the retreat map? Interesting. But it was good other than that. It was... I felt like chapters 10 and 11 were very well made. Um, definitely put you in a situation... Like, it really... It wasn't like, oh, we took your rings, but also made it easy to win otherwise. It was like... We took your rings, now we're going to put you in a situation where you're constantly desperate. And I think that was incredibly well made, uh, manufactured. I still want to know how Vale stole the rings off her fingers during the conversation. She took back the um, the dragon uh, crystal. So she just re She basically abused the time mechanic, stole it from them. HC Ghost, welcome to the stream. Hope you're doing well. I don't know how she got the tight crystal back too, but I don't know. Well, she said that she did take it while they were being distracted, but magic. Very much magic. Yeah, that's what the game said, but I don't know. It doesn't really make sense because the stone can only rewind time. That's far from the biggest issue I've had with the story. So, all we, all we are aware of is that the stone can only rewind time. But remember, the stone doesn't belong to us. The stone belongs to Vale. So it's not unheard of that Vale uh, knows of other ways to use the magic crystal, right? So I understand it. It does sound a little contrived, but it could be explained that way. Could be. Let the show begin. Oh, there's really no one else here. Ready, Black Rose. Thank you for the community hydrate. Everyone, please take a sip of water and check your posture. You just want your rings back, you'll have to work for it. Otto, with great power comes great responsibility. Oh, what, uh, shit, what did, um... <laughs> what did Tony say to, spite, to uh, Tom Holland? Something about, like, you don't need the suit. If you needed a suit to be a hero, you were never ready to be a hero. Something like that. I don't know. I can't remember. Something like that, though. <laughs> See, Spider-Man is relevant in all cases, even Fire Emblem. Now you will take your rings. It's okay, you'll get your rings back soon. For nothing without the suit, then you shouldn't have it. Thank you! you down on me? 
you do start to get new ones pretty quickly, so it's not like you get to play without rings for long. Yes, HC Ghost is right. And it kind of gives you an opportunity to check out what the other rings are, too. Like that one that flashed across your screen that you probably shouldn't have seen. Just kidding, you said you didn't care. Oh my god. Thank you for patting Bruno Snake. Hmm. Sing five. That just means Lear needs to stand next to me. You're nothing without the soups that need the rings. If you are nothing without the rings, then you don't deserve the rings. Or something like that. Oh, okay, you're just gonna crit, so you didn't really need it. No apologies. Oh, you're really stuck. Awkward. Pieces. That would almost kill you. It was devastating seeing everyone turn red except for Roy. He was already red. <laughs> oh, that's actually very funny. He was only slightly red. I guess I do have to use the men's staff on you. Your attacks 41, 40. Oh boy, that's a lot. What do you get with resolve that? Um, plus five. Plus 10 in total. Puts you at... 28? You get 28, right? And they're gonna dunk the shit out of you. Probably better off fighting them once they so we all attack them up. Anyways. On fragments. I don't know. Choice is yours. I head out. Good luck and have a good stream. Thank you, Otto. Appreciate the raid as always. You have a great night. I'm not gonna get here in time, are they? Guys, the killer axe users. I need to. Everyone else push forward.
Cool archers. Your steward's ready. We only have one turn left on ours. Keen dodge. Clean. I can always reset if this doesn't work. <laughs> No damage. Always rewind in case, yes. They have like a ton of HP though. Great. Nice. Even mighty ones fall. These guys are definitely scary. They're really fast too. Oh boy. They can. It'd be nice if I can't tell, but I don't. <laughs> oh, I'm surprised they only have four move. I guess. They're modified, so they move slower. Hold on. Someone range, someone melee. You're up, Annette. Quality time. Uh, after unit X or weights restores 5 HP to adjacent and slightly decreased slope. Interesting. Alright, let's see if we need to rewind. to see that. 
Zero percent hit. Love to see it. Dream well. Don't crit, don't crit, don't crit. Nice. We could have been friends. No, you wouldn't. Why would you become friends with this guy? Oh, this is the boss. Stay. Retribution is due. Okay, he's left. Well, that's so scary. That's so scary, it's kind of funny. Hortensia definitely needs HP. Please get some HP. Thank you. That's a good level up. Ragnell. Irvin. <laughs> oh, break. But, like, this is insane. Like, look at Killer Axe. I have a 77% chance of critting. Let's have some fun. Love to see it. He's land this Thor on. <laughs> Very nice. For the divine dragon. If I may. I'm sorry. Wow, oh, Iron Sword. More money. Uh, just dance. Verily. My goodness, how awful! Right. Please don't crit Kagetsu. Please don't crit. Thank you. Alright. 
Who has damage to kill? Let's see, very ten percent. If I play this correctly, I could technically enhance a ton of people. I'm trying to think how would I go about doing I think I can only dance two people. Even mighty ones fall. We could have been friends. Very nice. <laughs> I can't believe that actually hit. I gotta dance everyone. Let the lesson begin. Oh, that gives you so much EXP, Pendreo. Love to see it. Forty four, holy shit. Well, they won't hit because I'll break. That'll be fine. I planned this out perfectly. I'm not scared of this, because this will just break. And I'll finish off with, um... With Ivy. We could have been friends. Definitely on maddening mode, I'd be a lot more scared to take these guys on. That was very easy. There's not even any more units to it. They'd have to wait one more turn anyways, right? Because, yeah, Seedal needs to escape, not me. Seedal can't even escape this turn.
guess end of the turn. I don't think there's anything else to pick up there. I think I picked up all the shinies. Really, it's just like, hey, go heal to me, I guess. I could also, like, spend a billion turns leveling uh, seed all up with dancing. <laughs> all set then. Go ahead and end the chapter. Our paths diverge for a moment. Divine One, Emblem Corin. Thank you. Thanks. Easy, guys. That was easy. We're safe. Hang on. Someone's at the entrance. Don't tell me. More of the corrupted. Is everyone okay? I saw it's Vale. Just coming in and got worried. Vale. Oh my. We meet again. Did you defeat the monsters? <sighs> yes, we did. Every last one. Except for you. I'm glad. How have you been? I was surprised to see you out in that blizzard. I hope you found the cathedral. Whatever game you're playing, stop it. Huh? Are you mad about something? Don't act like you forgot. I can see through your lies now. Lies? What do you mean? I promise you, I'm not... Not a step closer. You stay where you are, Fel Princess. <sighs> How did you know? Just looking at you. I feel again the shame of losing father. You took my country from me. My father. What more do you want? The people you killed? They had families. But you don't care, do you? All that pain. You don't even give it a second thought. Wait a moment. I... I killed people? Who? Drop the act. You know what you did. How dare you show your face here. You murdered my mother and stole the rings. I didn't. I didn't. Please believe me. Believe you? Like I believed we were friends? I won't make that mistake again. <laughs> That's so cruel. We've got to do something. Let her go. It's probably a trap. Ah, <sighs> you're right. Divine One? Are you all right? I'm fine. But the next time I see Veil, vale, I swear. That really hurts. <laughs> But it would be too dangerous to bring her along with us right now. What if she ever turns back into evil Vale? Mm. <sighs> it's like frame rate loss every time you talk Thank to you. someone. If I may. Kato? Come in with me, Kato. <laughs> Feel! I'll go.
gets. Silver. Olmec. It's a tiger cat. Or a leopard cat. Leopard cat. Guys, it's Sora. On Sora. So, hey there. Can't bring you home with us, Sora, because I don't know how to take care of you. I think it's interesting how they kind of just benched Saline almost immediately. I mean, like, the story has pretty much benched Saline. She's not even relevant anymore. <laughs> she doesn't have any input on what just happened. But of course, Alfred does. Both princes do. Princess, uh, even Fogato has no input on what just happened. 420, let's go! Killed people? Stole rings? Why would I do that? I don't understand. Lady Vale, I finally caught up with you. Oh, Chris, it's you. You're a hard girl to find. Why'd you disappear? had me all freaked out. Papa told you to drag me back home, right? Told me to... Huh? Oh, I see what's going on here. You're the other one. I'm not going back. No matter what you say, Papa will just make me do something cool. You already have. I, woke. I thought we could finally spend time together. But no. Always telling me to kill the Divine Dragon. Or attack so and so's castle. Well, I don't want to. I'm not an evil person. Despite what all those people said, even the Divine Dragon was angry with me. And I thought we were friends. The Divine Dragon said you were friends? Wait, you met the Divine Dragon? Mm hmm. Oh, that's complicated. Look, whatever those people told you, it's not true. They were imagining things. You think so? Of course. How could you have done something bad and then forgotten it? She's being gaslit. Right. No! Right. I couldn't have. If only I'd said that before, maybe there wouldn't be this awful misunderstanding. You want to try and speak with them again? Set things straight? I do. But weren't you going to bring me back? If this is what you want, I'll help out. Nothing if not loyal, that's me. All right. Thank you, Chris. It seems I misjudged you. It's settled then. Let's head to Firine. Firine? Why there? Because that's where the Divine Dragon is going. How do you know that? Come on, we're on a schedule here. Gotta head for the port and set sail. Do you want to patch things up or don't you? I do. I do, you're right. No time to waste. <laughs> this ought to be real interesting. Boy. All right. Go ahead and end it here for tonight. We actually went on a lot longer than I wanted to. Um, I guess that's what happens when you play missions. And... Thank you all for coming. Um, yeah. <laughs> I really appreciate it. Uh, we made quite a bit of progress. But I think we're spending a lot of time just in the prep phase. It's not... I do it because I... I actually have fun doing all the prep, but I know it's not the most interesting thing. But I like, you know, optimizing everyone's uh, sets so that I'm not going to face any trouble 
for these missions. And I know it'll be a good habit to build once we get to Maddening Mode. But even though I do it now and it's not 100% necessary, it does make the missions go a lot easier. You don't have to think so hard about getting out of every single mission. It is what it is. Okay. Um. Oh, I'm surprised Flare is still alive. Let's go say hi to Flare, why don't we? Alright. You all have a great night. I'll see you all on... I might be streaming on Thursday. But I might either be late or I'll have to postpone it. Because I might have to stay late on work. At work on Thursday. <laughs> it's gonna be a long day, so I might have to postpone our the Thursday stream too. I'll see you guys then. Take care.